Hello everyone. This video is going to talk about the Hitachi 3.5 inch hard drive PCB board swapping. The Hitachi 3.5 inch hard drive PCB board swapping is quite different from the other hard drive PCB board swapping. First, there is a ribbon cable between the board and the hard drive motor connector which is very easy to be broken when taking off the board. Second, there is a hook on each side of the hard drive case, which needs your attention when taking off the board. Third, the PCB board compatibility is very strict. The board number, the sticker number, and the main IC number must be same and also the PCB board firmware transfer is a must. This picture shows the PCB board compatibility and where to find the each number of the board. This picture shows where to find the model number of the hard drive. Go to www.hdd-parts.com to search for the correct donor board. Now, we found the correct donor controller board for this hard drive. Please read the item description and follow the instructions. This picture illustrated how to take off the PCB board from the hard drive. 1. Pull out the clips from the two sides of the connector to release the ribbon cable. 2. Unscrew all the screws. 3. Slice out the board from the hook. Why do we have to do the controller board BIOS transfer? Because for this model hard drives, one controller board includes two parts, hardware and controller board BIOS. The controller board BIOS includes hard drive's unique configuration data. The hard drive needs this unique configuration data to work. So, we have to transfer this unique configuration data from the original board to the donor board then the donor board can work on the original hard drive. Regarding the hard drive controller board BIOS transfer, we want to point out the following things. 1. We can do the controller board BIOS transfer from the physically damaged controller board, like burned, watered, or other kind of damage. Our controller board BIOS transfer success rate is more than 95%. 2. Controller board BIOS transfer is different from the hard drive firmware upgrade. The controller board BIOS transfer is to transfer the controller board BIOS from one board to another board. So we can make two identical controller boards. Hard drive firmware upgrade is to upgrade the hard drive's own firmware. It nothing to do with another hard drive or another controller board. We cannot make two identical controller boards by hard drive firmware upgrading. 3. We do the controller board BIOS transfer for our clients for free. This picture illustrated how the controller board BIOS transfer works. On the left hand side is the original bad board. On the right hand side is the donor good board. The controller board BIOS transfer means to transfer the controller board BIOS from the original bad board to the good donor board. 
This picture shows how to put on the PCB board. One, slice the board into the hook. Two, screw in all the screws. Three, insert the ribbon cable into the connector, and then put in the clips to lock in the ribbon cable in the connector. In the item description part, you can find a firmware transfer form. Please fill this form, print it, and ship together with the board. This picture shows how the clients ship their PCB board to us to do firmware transfer. This picture shows how we ship the donor board to our clients. We carry old brand name hard drive PCB board. If you cannot find the correct donor board or have other questions, you may take pictures of a hard drive and the PCB board email to us. We will find the correct donor board or the best solution for you. Thank you so much for taking your precious time to watch my video. Any comments are really appreciated. If this video is a little bit of help, could you please click on like to support me? Thank you again. Bye.